In 2025, it is projected that over 8 million hybrid cars will be made, each with a range extender. A range extender generates electricity and runs on standard pump fuel, allowing the vehicle to charge on the move as required. This electricity is stored using an onboard battery or supercapacitor, which is used to power the motors and the vehicle. In addition to excellent drivability and low running costs, this gives an electric vehicle the flexibility of long-range travel. First-generation range extenders have directly coupled a reciprocating internal combustion engine to a conventional rotary electrical generator. However, the required output of a range extender is electrical power, not rotary motion. With this in mind, a new generation of range extenders are under development, which can convert fuel to electrical energy in a more direct and efficient way. The layout of a free-piston engine combines two opposed combustion chambers and a common mover with a piston located on either end. A linear motor generator is integrated with the mover. Used as a motor, it helps start the engine and its movement directly generates electrical power. A free-piston design is over 30% more efficient than conventional rotary engines, with proven thermodynamic efficiencies of between 40 and 50%. By removing the crankshaft and crankcase, a free piston engine is more efficient, cheaper to manufacture, compact and easy to maintain. The configuration offers full control over the fuel injection, spark, intake and exhaust valve parameters and by controlling the linear motor generator, the system can be used to accurately position the piston during the cycle. When shown on a pressure volume diagram, this maximizes the enclosed area in comparison to a conventional reciprocating engine. This means that more useful energy is extracted, improving efficiency and fuel economy. Piston position control can also exploit the potential of a whole range of conventional, sustainable and future fuels with only changes to software rather than hardware. These factors make a free piston engine the ideal solution for next generation ultra high efficiency range extenders. The fourth generation free piston engine research prototype is currently under test at the Sir Joseph Swan Centre for Energy Research at Newcastle University. It has been designed in collaboration with SR Technology Innovations to validate models, establish a robust control strategy characterize and optimize the engine performance and support the optimization of future designs. The Joseph Swan Center is the highest cited research group in the world on free piston engine technology and has been developing prototype systems for 15 years. SR Technology Innovations has a track record in building new energy technologies to improve low carbon vehicle performance and develops concept designs through to vehicle demonstrators. The Mark V prototype is a compact 24 kilowatt 800 cc four-cylinder design for an electric hybrid vehicle. In this design, two free piston engine units are located side by side and run out of phase with each other to improve the mechanical balance of the engine. This helps reduce noise and vibration on board a vehicle. The range extender has been designed around two linear generators with the spark plugs, injectors and valve housings installed at either end. On a sub-component level, the design does not require any technical breakthroughs and its development builds on established methods used in reciprocating engine design and manufacture. A single cooling loop is used to cool the electrical components and the engine to simplify vehicle installations. Air is drawn through a common intake manifold to the cylinders. After combustion, the gases exit the cylinders through the exhaust manifold. The intake system is located on the upper side of the generator. Overall, the prototype measures 535 by 200 by 210 millimeters, offering the highest specific power for a range extender engine. The electronic control of the piston's position offers major advantages in terms of operation and fuel flexibility. This ultra-high efficiency and lower cost of manufacture and maintenance means this system promises major improvements for the next generation of range extender technology.